Hi guys! Good evening! Welcome or welcome back sa aking YouTube channel. At ngayon ay pupunta ako sa sa City Hall para sa aking cooking class. So, this is organized by the international section of the City Hall. And some of the AATs also signed up for this one. Tapos, it's from 6 to 8 in the evening. So, yes. Punta muna tayo. Magliwaliw. <laughs> Pero once lang to. Next time naman, we will have kimono tour. So, as much as possible, I am joining a lot of the, of the events in my prefecture. So this cooking class was held on November 29th, 2021, and this class was offered to the AETs or ALTs, and since bagong bago tayo dito sa ating placement, ay super genki tayo. So kahit anong activity pa yan, ay talagang sinasalihan ko talaga. So actually, ito po ay Japanese learning class. So bale, the idea was to learn Nihongo while cooking. Divang saya. So for this class, I spent 800 yen registration fee, pero it's all worth it kasi kakainin din lang namin lahat ng aming mga niluto. So here, we were taught to cook and prepare rice sandwiches or also known as onigiri with egg and beef fillings and egg and tuna fillings. So, from the prep, to cooking, to eating, to pagliligpit, lahat po yan ginawa namin within 2 hours. And, meron pa akong take-home na pagkain. So, bali, dito po sa klase namin to, ako yung pinaka-beginner in terms of Japanese language proficiency. But, my senpais are really, really, really helpful. So, next naman po ay yung aming Aizume class na na-held noong January 20th, 2022. So, recently lang po siya. And, I also like this one. Dahil, we also learn Japanese language and culture while making our own indigo tie-dye. So, here I paid 500 yen. So, nagtali kami ng mga rubber bands or tali sa aming mga cloth. Tapos, ibinabad namin sa dye. And then, pagkatapos namin tinanggal yung mga tali, ay binanlawan namin, saka namin pinatuyo. Akalain nyo yun, dito ko pa talaga sa Japan mararanasang gumawa ng aking first ever tie-dye. So, masaya po siya, lalo na at natututo rin kami ng Japanese language. And yung bonding namin as AETs here are talagang naging strong. Lalo pa at bago-bago pa lang tayo dito. Hello po! So, kauwi po natin galing sa ating Aizumi class. At ipapakita ko po sa inyo yung ating finished product. Yay! Ayan po. So, ito po yung ating ginawa today. So, meron po tayong cloth dito. So, this is like jellyfish inspired. And meron na rin tayong bag na ating dinesign din. So, hindi masyadong kita yung kanyang design, pero I can do better next time. So, yan po. I'm so happy for today. So, napaka-fruitful ng ating araw ngayon. At ang masasabi ko lang po siguro ay habang meron pong mga ino-offer na activities ang inyong area, ay dapat join lang po kayo ng join. Especially po sa ating mga newbies. And I actually want to say na mas marami pa po akong may share So, last time we also went to Sukagawa. And then we also went to Kitakata and also Iwaki. So, kung hindi nga lang po pandemya ngayon, ay sigurado pong mas marami pa po sanang mapupuntahan si Jasmine Donna. Pero, again, health is our priority and also our safety. Kaya, next time na lang tayo ulit gagala. Anyways, papalapit na rin po yung spring vacation. So, thank you so much again for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa aking Japan Ventures. Thank you and see you!